be reflecting on the line, Joyful all ye nations rise. All across our world there is pain and suffering in all nations. Wars, famines, natural disasters, hatred, discrimination, families forced to flee from their homes. Today the nations are full of grief, sorrow and sadness. So what difference does Jesus make in all of this? Why is his arrival a cause for joy among the nations? Everywhere that he went, Jesus spoke about the arrival of the kingdom of God. He talked about a new way for people to live with God as their king. In John chapter 6 verse 35, Jesus said, I am the bread of life. Whoever comes to me will never go hungry, and whoever believes in me will never be thirsty. Jesus offers a real hope to a hungry world, not by offering more food, but by offering true life, a relationship with God the Father. In Luke chapter 6, verse 27, Jesus says, Love your enemies, do good to those who hate you. Jesus' response to a world controlled by hatred is to fight against it with love and forgiveness. He proved his commitment to this kind of love by being willing to die on the cross to rescue all people. Like a ball spinning backwards, Jesus sets into motion a new way for the world to work. A new kingdom is coming, one that brings joy to all of the nations. Father God, we thank you for sending Jesus. Thank you for the way that he showed us how to love and care for others. Father, we ask that you would fill us with joy. Help us to share with everyone the promise of God's love and forgiveness.